Hi, DIYers. Joe here from Alarm Grid, and today we're going to talk about how loud the siren is on the L5210 panel. The system that we have right here is an L5210, and as you can see, it has a four and a half inch screen touchscreen, and the built in siren is right down here on the bottom. I just want to go over some features on the system first in case you have one of these in your home and you're wondering what it can do. The system is relatively versatile and it's still compatible with all of Honeywell's new remote services. Some modules that you may want to install in the system if you do have one, one of the more common ones is the L5100 Wi-Fi module. What this will allow you to do is connect the system to a Wi-Fi network and this supports all of the system's communication. That means is that you can have just this module installed and the system can be fully monitored and you'll be able to access it with Total Connect 2.0. Another module that we recommend as it's very inexpensive is the L5100 Z-Wave module. What this will allow you to do is interface the system with home automation devices such as lights, locks, thermostats, and other compatible Z-Wave things that you may have in your home. It's a very versatile little module, and if you have Total Connect 2.0, you'll actually be able to control all of your uh, automation devices right through the application and on the system too. Another very popular module for this panel is the 3GL cellular module. This module lets it connect to an AT&T 3G network and it does support all of its alarms communication. So if you just want to use this with cellular, you can certainly do so on this panel. One of the benefits of the cellular and the Wi-Fi module is that you, if you install both of them in the system, it can work with dual path communication. What that means is that if the Wi-Fi uh, network or the Wi-Fi communication goes down, the system's going to automatically roll over to cellular communication and continue to signal out. It's a great way to have a redundant path of uh, communication in your system, and we do recommend it as Wi-Fi is relatively spotty. Going back to the system itself, the internal siren has an 88 decibel output and is fairly loud. If you have a small home or an apartment, it may suffice to, to wake you up. Many customers are perfectly okay with the system, but many other customers do require or do want an additional siren option. If you have this panel mounted by your front door and your bedroom's on the second floor or further in the house, you may feel that it's not gonna wake you up or even notify you if it does go off. There are other siren options with the panel. Three of the main ones are the first is the, the 5800 Wave Siren. It's a wireless siren that only requires to be plugged into an outlet. The benefit to that is how easy it is to install. You can place it in a bedroom hallway, in the bedroom itself, or anywhere that you really want to be notified of an alarm. The downside to the 5800 Wave is that it only outputs 77 decibels, and for some people that's just not loud enough. If you do require a louder siren, there's two kits that we do sell. One is called the Lynx EXT, the other is called the Lynx WEXT. These are kits that allow you to integrate a wired siren with the system, and as long as the siren doesn't overdraw the power supply that's in the kit, you can use whatever model you'd like. The benefit to that is that wired sirens are usually much louder than any of the wireless sirens that are available, and it absolutely can be louder than the internal siren on the system. With the kits, you can install an outdoor one on the side of the house that you're notified outside. You can put a louder one inside of the house, and it just kind of opens up some options for you to install whatever siren you'd like with the panel. That's pretty much the L5210's internal siren. Keep in mind it's 88 decibels. If you did enjoy the video, head over to our website, alarmgrid.com. Check out what we have to offer. Also, hit subscribe, and if you'd like to get notified of future videos when we post them, click the notification button and you'll do so. Thanks for visiting and have a great day.